Hi, my name is Alex Jordan, and I'm a psychologist. I see clients here in my office at McLean Hospital in Belmont. My background as a clinician is in PTSD and other trauma-related difficulties, but I see a wide variety of clients, and I recognize that most people's problems can't really be captured so well by a single diagnosis. Um, and if I'm working with a client on a presenting problem of depression or anxiety or insomnia or substance abuse or what have you, um, I really try to also pay a lot of attention to uh, the client's general personality style and how that might contribute to the recurrence or the maintenance of those problems that brought them into therapy and that hold them back in their lives generally. So a lot of the clients I see are feeling anxious or fearful about something whether that might be uh, worries about tomorrow or intrusive memories of a traumatic event from the past, or maybe a specific kind of situation like social settings. And uh, with these kinds of problems, one of my specialties is called exposure therapy. And that involves gradually facing down the anxiety head on, exactly the opposite of what we really want to do in those situations, but to help clients go through that and by that process, uh, they have a lot of success in really defanging their fears. Most of the work that I do is behavioral in orientation. And uh, what that means is that I take a, a very active and practical role in the therapy. I try to collaborate with clients to identify some actions they can take outside of the therapy sessions, between the sessions. I mean, I, I try to maintain humility about the fact that you might only be in here for one out of 168 hours in the week. Uh, there's probably nothing so magical, unfortunately, in the session that you're going to have a breakthrough in your life unless there are some changes happening outside of the session and all the other hours of the week. Um, something I really pay attention to in the therapy process is making sure that we're not just focused on shrinking the size of the problems you might be dealing with in life, uh, but also enlarging what's meaningful and connecting and engaging. Uh, that's an extremely important part of the work, and I'm always paying, paying close attention to that aspect of things. If you have any questions at all about me or about my practice, please feel free to reach out by phone or email. You can also visit my website at alexjordanphd.com. I wish you well in finding a therapist who's a good fit for you, and uh, if you do decide that you want to schedule an initial session with me, I very much look forward to meeting you.